Hey everyone, welcome back to IT and Automation Academy. Today, we've got a special treat for those of you interested in pursuing a career as a PLC programmer. We'll be sharing 15 tips on how to get that dream job. Before we start this video, if you are new to channel, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. If you find yourself unemployed and uncertain about how to secure a job as an automation engineer, this video serves as a comprehensive guide. It has the potential to transform you from being at ground zero to becoming a hero in your job search journey. So, without further ado, let's jump right in. First things first, make sure you have a solid understanding of the basics of PLC programming. This includes knowing programming languages like ladder logic, structured text, and function block diagrams. Tip number two, pursue relevant education. Consider obtaining a degree in electrical engineering or related field. Look for courses and certifications specifically focused on PLC programming to enhance your skills. Tip three is all about practical experience. Secure internships, co-op programs, or work on personal projects to apply your theoretical knowledge in real-world scenarios. This hands-on experience will make you stand out to potential employers. Tip 4. Master multiple programming languages. While having a strong grasp of one language is crucial, being proficient in several will broaden your skill set and make you more versatile in the field. Stay ahead of the game with tip number 5. Stay updated with industry trends. The field of industrial automation is always evolving, so make sure you're aware of the latest technologies, standards, and best practices. Networking is key. Tip number six is to build a strong network. Attend industry events, join online forums, and connect with professionals in the PLC programming community. You never know when an opportunity might arise through your connections. Tip 7. Create an impressive portfolio. Showcase your projects. Highlight your achievements. And make sure your portfolio reflects your skills and passion for PLC programming. Consider pursuing advanced certifications for tip number 8. Certifications like Siemens Certified PLC Programmer or Rockwell Automation Certified PLC Technician can give you an edge in the job market. Online mentorship programs are one of best way to learn automation. We do offer different courses. For more details, contact us on WhatsApp number provided on screen. Tip 9 is all about continuous learning. The world of PLC programming is dynamic. So stay curious and keep updating your skills through workshops, online courses, and other learning opportunities. Tip 10. Hone your problem-solving skills. PLC programmers often encounter complex issues, and the ability to troubleshoot and find solutions efficiently is highly valued in the industry. For Tip 11. Make sure to tailor your resume for the job you're applying for. Highlight relevant skills and experiences that align with the specific requirements of the PLC programming position. Technical interviews are common in this field, so tip 12 is to prepare for them. Brush up on your technical knowledge. Be ready to discuss your projects and demonstrate your problem-solving abilities. Don't forget about soft skills. Tip 13 emphasizes the importance of showcasing your communication, teamwork, and adaptability skills during interviews. These qualities are just as crucial as technical expertise. Before applying, Tip 14 suggests researching potential employers. Understand the industries they operate in and the specific PLC systems they use. Tailor your application to demonstrate your alignment with their needs. Finally, Tip 15. Stay persistent and positive. Job hunting can be challenging. But don't get discouraged. Keep refining your skills, learning from rejections, 
and staying positive throughout the process. And there you have it, 15 tips on how to get a job as a PLC programmer. I hope you found these insights helpful on your journey to landing that dream position. If you have any questions or additional tips, feel free to share them in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more career tips. Until next time, bye-bye.